Comey, by the way, still says he's a Republican. Tammy Bruce is a Fox News contributor, and she joins me now. Tammy, yeah. top line thoughts on James Comey hitting the book tour. Yeah, it's almost comical. It would be like a satire because of his history. These interviews, nobody asked him about what he had been accused of, his firing, uh, Rod Rosenstein citing him for abandoning the principles of the FBI. Uh, he was fired. He then had passed on what is alleged as classified material, uh, notes that he'd written about President Trump to the media to continue the smear against President Trump. Uh, these are awful actions of someone in his position, and he still has the gall to walk around and to endorse as though he's a master of the universe. One, <laughs> one thing, it, and one thing he admitted is that he is concerned about Trump uh, prosecuting what he said were his enemies. So these are individuals who are worried about once again. This I think was an initial worry with Trump: is what have they been hiding? What will the new ah. president find? Like how people were concerned about Elon Musk and what he would find at Twitter, and boy, didn't he find a lot. Boy, didn't he ever. Yeah. Um, you know, it's pretty clear that President Biden will be running his new campaign, Tammy, much like he did the last one. By the way, this is the fourth time he's run for president, because he had two failed times before he finally got in the office. This guy is determined, but he likes to do it from the basement of any number of houses. The White House, the two in Delaware, blah, blah, blah. And it's all funded in part by his uber-rich friends, like the Illinois governor, J.B. Pritzker. A new report in Politico says the Democratic billionaire is planning a major fundraiser for Biden later this month. And, you know, I'm just curious. Does money make up the difference from the public or your contemporaries, like Robert mm. F. Kennedy Jr. running against you? getting a question in every now and then? Yeah, it makes a difference, especially for other donors. If you take the money and, and you know, DeSantis and Trump growing through this as well, where the donors go, if, if they're all putting their money in with Joe Biden, it's going to then limit the big money that's available for a Bobby Kennedy. It's going to limit money for uh. anybody else who might be running. So it sends a signal. What this tells me is that he is still worried, he doesn't have the power of the incumbency. He, his team is still worried about whether or not he would be the nominee, and he's still fighting to become the nominee. Uh, I think that's, that's important to know. That's interesting. Is there a chance he might not be? I think so. There's a long time to that point. Let's see what happens. A lot of weird things have been happening. Yeah, you know what? I had forgotten he fractured his foot one time. We didn't have that in our montage. Playing with the dog, that was only a couple of years ago. Yeah. I mean, it is sad. And, and we don't want him to be hurt. Of course. But the people in his party have to see that. Yeah. They, they have to see what we see. Great to have you on the program. Thank you. Thanks for having Thank me. Thank you. Great Absolutely. Stuff. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.